Good afternoon. Welcome to another live session with me, Vinod Jain. Welcome to Neetu's Academy Reading Live. I hope all of you are as eager as we are. You're all eagerly waiting to see us. Yes. I'm sure you all are. Right. So what are the things that we have in offer for you? See, please be aware of our free classes that I come in front of you Monday to Friday, the very same page with the very same link. Good afternoon, Jobita, Mamta Malik. Good afternoon, Punjab. Okay, fair enough. Now, just a few things just to give you an insight about, okay? See, please aware, be aware that this is an online platform and there are N number of fraudulent people available. So you have to be very cautious with them, even in our Telegram group, okay? See, please do not give answers and all for when they ask you in group, okay? See, what is the biggest problem is, see, when somebody asks you, okay, we are, can you share this answer? Can you share the answer? You are doing it for your thinking that those are genuine people. I'm not saying those are not all are not genuine, but there are a few fraudulent available. So we don't know how to differentiate. So Rinku and Reji, good afternoon. Jinsi George, good afternoon. Anilia George, good afternoon. Sibi Thomas, good afternoon. Israel, Jinsi George, good afternoon. So very, very, very good afternoon to all of you. Mamta Malik, as always, with flowers. Thank you. Anjana Anna, good afternoon. So coming back to what I was just telling. See, when you want, or if you want to share an answer key to anybody who have asked in the group, you can send them personally. See, why... Because there are answer keys that has copyright issue. Okay, and if you are sharing an answer key which is having copyright, and if you share, okay, that is what these fraudulent people want, and you will be banned from Telegram. Why? Because you have violated a copyright rule. Okay, so if they ask you share that answer key, share this answer key and all, be aware of it. It can be. Not saying all of them are bad, but there are bad people available. So you have to be very cautious. If you want to send them, you send them personally, not in a public group. Okay, just be aware of it. Alfonso Patrick, good afternoon. Albini, good afternoon. Asha Abraham, good afternoon. Priya Rakwar, good afternoon. Bharati, good afternoon. Right. Anybody who is attending for the very first time, please do let me know that you are attending for the very first time and also where you are from. Okay, that where is very important for me because I want to add on to my known people's list. Ninu Mohan, good afternoon. Sanita Sabo, good afternoon. John John, good afternoon. So I could see a lot of icons and we have just been the official Telegram page of Neetu's Academy. Just click that and you will be taken into the official group. And we have only one more group, which is the exclusive reading Telegram page. Both these groups are free, but in order to get you into the reading exclusive Telegram page, we have a scrutinizing policy. Only after double checking whatever the details that you have sent to our admin, then only we'll be accepting you into that group. Okay, but then what are the things that we have? Mega Charles, UA, Jinsi George, first time UAE. Thank you very much again. See, I have another known person from UAE. Right, we have a lot of things that we offer on behalf of Marin Rachel. Good afternoon. We do offer a lot of linguistic exams that we give training on. If you want to get insights, please do not hesitate to contact that number. They'll be happy to assist you. Okay, we have regular batches, we have crash courses available. So anything. And there are n number of exams which you might not know that can be an easy or you know where to take you to your dream country so there are different perspectives available or different exams revati gopal good afternoon ramya Jose, good afternoon so a few things that i want you to is is on the aspect of please do comment because even though it's a virtual reality the comment that you're going to type is how we communicate. So the more you comment, the more happy we all will be. And also, please do not hesitate to share. If you feel that this class is beneficial, please do share in your social media platform so that 
there are n number of people who are not aware of such classes and also I evaluate myself on the aspect if the shares are increasing then I would know that more people are feeling that this is in. Okay, this is beneficial. But if you think that it is not then you wouldn't share, isn't it? We always share something that we always feel that it is going to be good for others. So if you feel that this is going to be good for others, please do share. Bincy John, good afternoon. Simi Nibu, good afternoon. So, yes, what are the things that we do? We'll talk about two things, one a part B, and the other one is a part A, which I've already shared. Part B questions will be shared on the screen. Sharanya Manu, good afternoon. Mega again, good afternoon. And do not forget that Neetha Madam will be coming live with her writing depiction as well. Rose Maria, good afternoon. Anina Tommy, good afternoon. Okay, so are you all ready for today's session? If so, give me a quick thumbs up and say, yes, I am ready. Lavina Justin, good afternoon. Are you all ready for today's session? Yes. Let me see how many of you are eagerly waiting for today's session. Sajita Ratish, good afternoon. First time, thank you very much, Sajita. May I know where you're from as well? Blessy, very beneficial and before it was very hard because of you. I can do it. No, it's because of your hard work. We are only just telling you how to. Mega, yes. Bincy, good afternoon. Anjana, yes. Mamta Malik, ready. Jobita, ready. Revati, ready. What is the topic name, sir? Part B will be displaying on the screen. Sharanya, ready. Ramya, ready. Rose, ready. Blessy, ready. Simi, ready. Sajita Pala, okay. I have a few students from Pala as well now. I know more person for Pala. Priya Rakwal ready, Albini ready, Lavina ready, Anila ready, Grishma. I'm from Ireland. Okay, excellent. So few of you know our, our students, most aspiring country. So you're lucky there. Nino Mohan, yes, ready, John ready, Anu ready. All right, as you've all said, you're all ready. So the question, what we are going to do is we'll be displaying a part B question on the screen. Once you get the question, there will be a timer. Your job is to make sure that you beat the time. Okay, do find an answer on or before time, not after time. Okay, so as soon as the question pops up, do not hesitate. Madhusmita Bhaira, good afternoon. So the question will be popping up and when the question pops up, do not wait. Just do as what you're doing on the daily basis. Because you don't have more time. We have an issue with time. So we're just trying to make sure that you are all there. Okay. So I could see thumbs up and all popping. So I know that you're eagerly waiting for the question. Once the question comes, you should know what to do. Do not type your answers. Okay. Just once you have done, you found the answer, just put a thumbs up or say done. Okay, I'll tell you when to type the answers. Clear? All right. Mm, all right. Um, there are a few. Okay. There you have the question on the screen. Do not waste your valuable time. Just do the question and find an answer.
All right. The time just eluded. Yes, and Mega, I just saw your message saying that not clear. I think maybe it is your internet. Okay, because others are not able to, you know, they don't have such a kind of problem. Minu more good afternoon. Priya done, Jinsi done, Mamta done, Jobita done, Rose done, Karuna Bilare done, Sumanrangi done, Haryana, my friend. Okay, I'm just trying to recall. Anjana done, Kalai done, Minu more done, Simi done. Madhusmita Bara done. Okay, so all of you have done. And I think it was more. Sorry for late network issue. Do not worry. Revati Gopal done. John done. Nashka done. Blessy done. Suman, good afternoon. A very good afternoon. So I think after some time, today was the day that a lot of you have done on or before. You know, the time usually it gets on the verge of, you know, about to finish. Today, a lot of you have been a bit early. So be very well done. Right. Anila done. Excellent. Now, what are the things that you have to do when you're doing part B? See part B, once they take part A only, they'll give you the material. You have six questions. Six will be short questions and you'll have the appropriate passage also. Short passage and an appropriate question along with three options. The maximum time that you're going to take in order to do part B is two minutes per question, not more than that. Okay. Read the question, underline the keywords in the question, understand the question. Very, very, very important. After that, you can read the passage and pick an answer or you can read the passage, sorry, you can read the answer option, underline the keywords in the answer option and then pick an answer from the paragraph. Anything is fine. Okay. Now, strategy is elimination. Now, I just told the overall idea. Now, would you be kind enough to tell me what is your answer? Not just what is your answer, where you got that answer from. That where is very important for us. Lavina done. Okay, fair enough. Can you all tell me what is your answer and how you got that answer? Tell me. Let me, Albini done. Okay, fair enough. What is your answer and how you got that answer? That how is very, very important. CB is saying C. Okay, fair enough. Israel. Now, how you got C? Kale is saying C from overall understanding of para. Okay, fair enough. Vanilla Jod C, Lavina C, Karuna C. So, the initial thing is C is D. Okay. Anjana C from whole para. Alfonso Patrick C. Mega. Jisha, Jishi Emily, new name, C, Mamta Malik, C overall. Okay, so B, C, Gopal Das, West Bengal, C, C comparing with others, Jinsi George, C, Nina Mohan, C. Bless this career, C, Carmel Vijay, C, Jobita, C. Okay, so I think it was a very easy answer. All of you are saying C, C, C. No other, nobody else have got any other answers. All of you got C. Revati C. I got B from middle line. Okay, see me. Okay, now I have C and B. Fair enough. Jismi Hormus. C. Albini George C. Suman Rangi C. Along with what they said about mortality rate as the twelfth leading cause. Okay, fair enough. Sati Sajita, I think B because the parents more telling about the causes got confused. Okay, fair enough. So I have two B and the rest of C. All of you are going along with B and C. Okay, fair enough. Now you'll have the question. Nina B, Jin C, C, Priya got B. Now you'll have the material back on screen. Okay, now we'll see which one is answer, whether it is B or it is C. Okay, so once the material comes, I'll start telling you how it is. But Sharanya Manu is also saying B. Okay, now B is also increasing. Fair enough. Now you have the question on the screen. Now see, what is the first thing that you have to do? 
the first and the foremost important that you have to just now Jose is also saying be the extract gives more information now this is about more which is giving you more information Gina Tom C fair enough now natural history and outcomes of NASH okay or is it common causes of death or the mortality rate are comparison is it comparing now patient with NASH now what is NASH tell me how many of you know what is NASH what is NASH tell me Surya C no C okay what is NASH tell me How many of you know what is NASH? Let me see. Just type in. What is NASH? Because in the paragraph it is not saying, but of course, we expect you to know. So what is NASH? Nobody know. Nobody is typing. Why is that? You can you're you're thinking whether I'm right or wrong, isn't it? See, it's not about what others. If you know. Please do. Even if it's wrong, we are here to correct you. That is why we are here for you. We can be that facilitator. We can be that just now non-alcoholic. Yeah, non-alcoholic what? Non-alcoholic steato, steato hepatitis. Very good, Grishma. Good afternoon, Ramya. Good, good afternoon. Suman Rangi, non-alcoholic steato hepatitis. Fair enough, Mega Charles. So it's not that you don't know. You are giving me a shock, is it? Non-alcoholic hepatitis. Okay, fair enough. Now let's go into the passage. Minimal. Okay, fair enough. There is a growing evidence that the patient with histological NASH. So histological means something which is referring into the past, isn't it? So especially those with some degree of fibrosis are at higher risk of adverse outcomes such as cirrhosis, liver-related mortality. Lavina Justin, I always love a student who says, I'm not, I don't know. That also needs a challenge, isn't it? So good. So the answer to that is non-alcoholic steatohepatitis is an advanced form of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease NAFLD so because NAFLD is caused because of the buildup of liver fat in the liver when this buildup causes inflammation and damage it is known as NASH which can lead to scarring of the liver this is the general ideology but you don't need to just we are I'm just telling you because Lavina said you don't know fair enough now Patients with NASH have increased overall mortality compared to the match control population without NASH. Okay. So, mortality rate, a comparison. Is it comparing with something? Let's see. The most common cause of death in patients with NAFLD is cardiovascular disease, CVD, independent or other metabolic comorbidities. Although liver-related mortality is the 12th leading cause in general population and it's the second or the third cause of death among patients with NAS. Common causes of death. Common causes of death is not there. So that is eliminated. Okay, because the histological NAS, so they are talking about history also. So maybe, not sure. And mortality is also there. Now, let's say if there is any comparison or outcomes of NASH is mentioned. So, patient with NASH. Cancer-related mortality is among the top three causes, co sorry, these two causes of death in subject with NASH. So, cancer-related mortality. Okay. So, mortality rate a comparison cancer related mortality is among the top three causes of death in subjects with NASH. said patient with histological NASH have an increased river related mortality so now what are they talking about see mortality rate a comparison where are they comparing about the mortality rates where are they comparing 
Is there any way they are comparing the rates about the mortality? What rates? They are only saying alcohol related mortality. But the question is what? The passage is all about NASH. Although liver related mortality is 12th, okay, which is the cause of general population, it is the second or third cause of death among patients with NASH. Okay, fair enough. What? Where are they comparing with the mortality rate? Comparing. So, no comparison in there. Okay. So, of course, the answer is A. So, congratulations. This is the first time that none of you have got the right answer. Okay. It happens. It, it doesn't matter because... You are really cautious about keywords only. Okay, mortality, mortality, mortality. No. See, what are they saying? There is a growing evidence and the patient with histological NASH. So, they are talking about the history about NASH, especially those with some degree of fibrosis are at greater risk for adverse outcomes such as cirrhosis and liver related. Understood? Now, they are saying what is the natural history about NASH and what are the outcomes? See, they are talking outcomes in the last. Patient cancer related mortality is among the top three causes of death in subject to, and patient with histological NASH have an increased liver related mortality rate. So, that is the outcome of that. Understood? Why A came? Clear. See, that is why I've always told you. Why am I happy for no one? <laughs> right. See, it's not about being happy or thing. You have to enjoy, isn't it? When we make something bad on that also, you have to take it on a very positive way. See, I went and referred, okay? What happens with students is, they, they don't know what natural history, no history and all mentioned. See, history and all will be not be mentioned as such, isn't it? Not one word. They're going to refer from the past. So that is why it is, they're giving a clear entry onto it. See, there is a growing evidence. So that is what the history they're talking about. With patients with histological NASH, that there are some degree of fibrosis and are at higher adversary outcomes such as cirrhosis as well as liver-related mortality. So this is what the entry. Clear. So this is how you have to. And another important thing what you do is, see, you simply avoid, okay, history not mentioned, this is not mentioned. Okay, so don't, don't assume it. See, mortality rate, where is the comparison? Where are they talking about the mortality rates? Nowhere. So that should have been the first one to eliminate. No comparison also. Clear? Right. There you have the Part Lavina, thank you for clarifying doubts. It's always a pleasure, isn't it? Mamta clear, Jinsi clear, Suman clear, Jobita clear, Minimal got it, Charanya clear. Fair enough, fair enough. Any doubts? Anything that you want me to clarify? Nice surgery, easy material. Okay, fair enough, Jobita. Anila George is saying easy. All right, fair enough. I'm sorry, Anita George, Anita George, Anila George is saying clear. Okay, fair enough. Right. So as usual, my next question will be, what is today's party and how you felt about today's party? Jobita has given me maze surgery easy, maze surgery easy, colleague. Fair enough. Karuna Bilare, clear. Mamta is a rosemary is a so few days you're getting you getting more easy material, is it? I think it is your hard work that is making all those materials go easy. So men we all was happy because we got option C and think that only C will be correct answer. That is what? See I always believe see there might be there might be a student who have would have got A, but the problem with them is they're not grabbing the opportunity. Because if at all they had the courage to say, I got A from here, who would have been in the limelight? That person would have got A. 
But because you don't grab an opportunity, because you're worried about, oh my God, others are saying, see, see, it's not about what others. See, there's always a, a saying which I always remember. A group led by, sorry, a group, a herd of sheep led by a lion is more mightier than a group of lion led by a sheep. Now, I want you to be that lion only. See, it is not what a leader should be is, you grab the opportunity. See, I'm getting this. I'm taking my responsibility on the aspect of, okay, I got this. Because I have done so much of hard work, learning, reading and this. And my mind is saying, Mamta Malik, you are right, sir. I got answer A. Then I thought I might be wrong. Fair enough. See, don't follow the group. Let the group follow you. Isn't it? So, men, yes, fair enough. Maze, minimal, easy material. So, all of you are saying it is easy, easy, easy. So, you'll have the material on the screen now. Okay, and then we'll do. See, part A will be the first material that you're going to get. Okay, and you have to, the strategy changes, everything changes because the type of question, everything is different to part B and C. So, your strategy for part A is called skimming and scanning. What's the strategy called? Skimming and scan. Now, what are the things that you have to do in order to skim? See, you have to underline the keywords. So, skimming and scanning is the strategy. So, skimming means quick look, scanning means detail look. Okay. You have 15 minutes, 20 questions. Roughly one question, 45 seconds. So, each text... You can take about 15 seconds to skim. That means roughly about one to two minutes, the maximum that you're going to take to skim through the four texts. First, you have to go through the text. Then you go to the question. Underline the keywords and keyword reference should be the way that you find the answers in part B. Because most of you carry that same strategy into B. And B is not about the same strategy. Okay. Now, generally, I used to skim A, text A, text B, and all. Generally, see, this is a type of fast surgery. It is done in the upper chamber. All those atria, arterial, sorry, atrial fibrillation, and all those things. Okay. Then they're saying it is called short like this, and it's heart arrhythmias, dangerous medical condition, double risk, increased risk, five to seven times. Patient will compare with, and maize is tried to treat, health medicine, other procedure. Doctor give general anesthesia. So, what are the things the doctor is going to give? You will be in the intensive care unit for two to three days after surgery. So, whatever the after surgery is going to be mentioned now, I'm going to go to text D, where screening for atrial fibrillation or fibrillation. So, what are they talking about? Recommendations, class, level. So, all these recommendations, which class are we in and what are the levels that we in are all mentioned in text D. Now, going into question. So, you have to understand these 20 questions are divided into three types of questions. One to seven, these type of questions are called match the following question where you are expected to write the answers A, B, C or D. Understand? If your skimming is proper, if you have underlined the key, uh, keywords properly, finding the answer for A, B, C, D is, is absolutely easy. You don't even have to go through the text also. Now, I'll show you why. Right. Who is in charge of the function of heart throughout the procedure? So, where are they talking about all these throughout the time and all those? So, I feel that it is there in text C, is it? So, who is in charge? So, it is there in, sorry, the question, who is in charge is, the answer is in text B. Very sorry, I missed it. Okay. If you really look into, an incision will be made through and this cap next, the heart will be connected to the heart-lung machine and this machine will take over the function. If you would have underlined it clearly, the answer to question number one would be B. Okay. Best method to assess AF in older people. So, where are they talking about old age and all? It is there in the very same thing. Why? Because age greater than 75 years. So, the answer is very simple. It will be in J. Why is May surgery entitled so? What is the reason? What are the things? 
So it will be definitely, it describes intricately detailed maze of scar tissue and this is the form of, it is also named. So entitlement and all those things are mentioned in A. So the answer to that question is A. Now, why is it necessary to follow a post maze surgery? So the reason why, so the reasons are all mentioned, post-surgery, I told you, it should be there in C. Generally, you don't even really need to worry about. But if you want, sometimes people who have a maze procedure, it is necessary that they have a follow-up. So why is it? Because to determine additional ablation. So the answer is C. Who are able to get discharged from hospital in a very short period of time? So discharge hospital again, do you think that you need anywhere? For me, it is C. Why? Because after procedure, that is where your discharge is. Why? Because they're going to say, people who have had minimally invasive surgery leave the hospital. So the answer is, again, C. What is the prevalence of mortality rate associated with atrial fibrillation? So prevalence, where are they talking about? It should be there in A, I'm sure. Why? Because it is, all these prevalence is mentioned in A. So the answer to that question is A. How do the cuts made on the skin usually appear? So cuts, skin appear. So how are these cuts going to appear? Definitely it will be in B. Why? Because all these things are mentioned in B. Because your incision may look like a maze. So the answer is B. Understood why keywords are easy to find the answers 1 to 7. Now for the next set of questions, you have to always by heart this. 8 to 14, these are called short answer question, where you are expected to write the answers can be a word, short phrase. Please understand short phrase only. You're not going to underline big, big, big sentences and all short phrases, or it can be numbers or both number and phrase. Now, underlining keywords is going to be, okay, very nice, I forgot to ask, but still, you are all lovely students, where Jovita saying seven, Kale seven, Suman seven, Jinsi seven, Karuna seven, Sarita seven, Jinsi George six, Minu Mole seven, excellent. Good. So, which material is used to cover the skin or incision after procedure? So, some material, are, they want to use it to cover. So, which one is it? Okay, so where are they talking about all these? So, it should be there somewhere in B, isn't it? Madhusmita 7, Charanya 7, excellent. So, a bandage will be placed over the site. So, which is the material that is going to cover? It is the bandage. B-A-N-D-A-G-E is the answer. Good enough. Gina Tom 7, Rose 6, Anu Dilip 7. Didn't see bandage. Okay, fair enough. Minimum duration, ECG, short term. So minimum duration. So they are asking you what is the minimum period of time. So where are they talking about all these minimum period of time? So it should be there in. So at least 72 hours. All the others are as such. So 72 hours is the minimum period. Don't write at least. Why? Because the question is asking you minimum period. So it should be 72 hours. Excellent. Alternative name given for atrial fibrillation or erratic heartbeat. So erratic heartbeat means something which is irregular. So erratic, these are all common terminology that keeps on coming. Okay. So what is the answer? The answer to that question is heart arrhythmias. So where do you get that? You get that from Text A, heart arrhythmias. Okay. H E A R T A double R H Y T H M I A S is the answer. Excellent. So, what can be. Okay, I think you can't see the screen, isn't it? I think my connection just went off. Sorry for that. I'm just going to get back to you on the aspect of getting the screen on technology, isn't it? It keeps on happening. So very sorry for that inconvenience caused. Okay.
So and I know that you are all very understanding students. So sorry for that inconvenience cost. Yeah. I hope now you'll be able to get the material because God's own country, internet is always like that. Everybody is with their internet and at times it can happen. So we're trying to get get back to it. Okay. So mm, right. Now it'll be back on the screen. Okay. There you have. So yeah. So question number eleven. So let's see question number eleven. What can be prevented by consuming blood thinners post mesh surgery? So post surgery blood thinners prevented. So where are they talking about all these keywords? So post surgery, I told you where go straight to C. Now the problem is blood thinners. Where are these blood thinners? Blood thinners are not as such mentioned, but anticoagulants is mentioned. So what are those? In order to prevent blood clots. Very good. B L W O D C L O T S is the answer. Utilization of which devices are recommended for atrial high rate episodes? So atrial high rate episodes, it should be recommendation where? The word recommendation is there in D. Now see what are those recommendations? What are they recommending? It is recommended to interrogate pacemakers and ICDs. So two have to be mentioned, pacemakers and ICDs. So P-A-C-E-M-A-K-E-R-S and ICDs is the answer. So devices, so you have to understand it is more than one as well. So next question, which condition get enhanced by the presence of atrial fibrillation and the final exit? Now final exit, now that's a new word, okay? So final exit means it is referring to, what is the final exit? It is referring to death, okay? The final exit means we're leaving the whole world and going. So that is death. So which is the condition that leads to final exit, exit and all. So let's see where they're talking about. It is uh, atrial fibrillation is a dangerous medical condition that can double the risk of death and increase the risk of stroke. So not just final exit means death. So what is the other thing? It is going to, the condition is stroke. S-T-R-O-K-E, very good. Now, question 14. What might be needed extra to abolish atrial fibrillation? So something which is needed extra, what are those? So they are going to talk about all these things in text C, isn't it? So sometimes people may have a main procedure, will still need an additional catheter ablations. So what is the thing that is needed? What, is, what extra is needed? Catheter ablations. Okay, C A T H E T E R A B L A T I O N S is the answer. Now, question 15 to 20, these are called fill in the blanks question where the instruction remains as such short word, short, short phrase word, number, or a combination of both. But here you have to be very cautious about your redundancy. Okay, so the dash will get directed by the incisions made up the atria and look like a maze. So it should be there somewhere in text B, isn't it? So where are they talking about? See, the incision may look like a maze. They will direct the electrical impulses. So the answer is the electrical impulses. E-L-E-C-T-R-I-C-A-L-I-M-P-U-L-S-E-S. -E -E Question 16. Due to the result of corrective surgery, there would be intricately detailed maze of dash formation. So intricately detailed maze, where are they talking about? So it should be there in A. As such, the keywords are, they are intricately detailed. So what is that? It is going to, the answer is scar tissue. SC, not, yeah, Mamta, I think it's a typo. 
It's scar tissue. S C A R T I double S U E. Excellent. Question 17. People who are older than dash year of age are advised with systemic ECG monitoring. So dash years of age, only one place. So what is the years more than 75? So 75 should be written because all the others greater than is mentioned in the question. Years also mentioned. So only 75 should be your answer. Excellent. Uh, dash post surgery are carefully monitored with dash to know any further need for ablation. So the word which is missing is patient who have. So where are they talking about all these? It is there in C. So in need of ablation. So the patient who have gone undergone may surgery who must follow from their cardiologist. Okay. So the answer comes from cardiologist with their cardiologist. C-A-R-D-I-O-L-O-G-I-S-T. Less than 16. Prior to the beginning of DASH. So something before beginning. Atrial high speed episodes undergo ECG. Atrial fibrillation. So what are they going to talk about? So it should be there in D. So before considering what? They are going to talk about before initiating the AF therapy, because AF is already there in the question. So before initiating the therapy, AF is already there, so it is not needed, because AF is given, isn't it? Atrial fibrillation is already given. So AF therapy, maybe, may not be, but the most appropriate one is prior to the beginning of the of therapy. AF therapy, maybe, may not be. Okay, therapy is the most appropriate answer because atrial fibrillation is given, not AHRA. The patient who underwent the ultimate question for today are discharged couple of days after the procedure. So discharge goes straight to C. Is it? Yes, it is. Because depending on people who have had minimally invasive surgery, leave the hospital after couple of days, four days after the procedure. So the answer is minimally invasive surgery the answer is therapy the most appropriate answer for question number 19 but if you've written af i wouldn't say it is wrong completely but af is already given in the question so you're not supposed to write it according to OET. so the final answer is a three word answer minimally invasive surgery m-i-n-i-m-a-l-l-y i-n-v-a-s-i-v-e-s-u-r-g-e-r-y I have wrapped my 20 answers. Now it's high time that you have. If you have any doubts, please do clarify. If not, tell me what are your total scores. Let's see how many of you have made to a consistent 20 out of 20. 19 Karuna, excellent, good enough. How about others? Mm. Mamta Malik 19, excellent, good enough. Jobita 18, good enough, good enough, keep it up. Suman 17, good enough, good enough. Jinsi George 18, good enough, good enough. Madhusmita 20, absolutely good enough. Keep it up, miss. Keep on enjoying your achievement. Good. How about others? Kalai 17, good enough. Don't be. Whatever that you are getting, you take it into and see where that small mistakes that you have made. Sharanya 18, Minumol, see it's, it's okay, F therapy, but I would say therapy is the most, so try to put that 19. Good enough. Rose 17, Jinsi George 18, Jishi Emily 18, good enough, good enough. Right, any doubts with regards to any of these questions or anything that you want me to clarify just now, Joe 17, good enough. Anything that you're not clear about? Anything that you want me to clarify? Sir, we write 17 years along with 75. Is it considered wrong answer? Yes, it is wrong. Because the thing is mentioned in the question, isn't it? 75 years. Years is already given in the question. So if you write years again, it's called redundancy. It is wrong. This me harm is 17. Good enough. Good enough. There were lots of few, lots of new names, but nobody said except for very few said who are new. So today I had a new student from UAE as well as from Pala. 
Fair enough. Madhusmita is saying thank you. Amrita is saying thank you. Jinsi George is saying thank you. So as you all have started saying thank you, it's high time that on behalf of Neetu's family, a big thanks to all my lovely students. Until and unless I see you all tomorrow. Adios from me. God bless you all. Take care. Bye.